Culture. Arts. Education. There is just one way to bring the world together. That way can only be through arts education, which promotes artistic talent and creativity for a new world. The history of culture and the arts coincide with the history of humanity. Only recently, the values of artistic experiences and creativity are explored in a new way, which brings worldwide recognition. Today, culture and the arts are touted as a source of added value in the economic perspective. However, they are the most talked about the key to sustainable development. Artists actively try to convince students and the general public to participate in arts education. This allows them to know more about culture and the arts, to know the importance of spiritual value, and to know sharing can make us affluent. In a society made by individuals who live a cultural and artistic life, they will naturally accept or tolerate differences between each other and try to respect and keep the ideals of coexistence and sustainability. The Second World Conference aims to affirm our advocacy for arts education and announces the importance of arts education all over the world. Convened at the initiative of UNESCO that connect with its 193 member states and in close partnership with the Korean government, the Second World Conference will take place in May of 2010 from the 25th to the 28th in Seoul, Korea. Successive to the first World Conference held in Portugal, the second World Conference will be held in Asia for the first time. We hope this event will be one of the best. There will be over 2,000 participants and experts in the area of arts education from all over the world. This conference aims to report regional survey results on its implementation status and establish a solid framework for further actions in developing core competencies. The program will comprise four-day series of plenary sessions, 26 parallel workshops, and special sessions like NGO forums, as well as various cultural experiences. In parallel workshops, the way to achieve specific methods for a practical plan of the roadmap and diffusion to social cultural value will be discussed. In particular, a plan will be dealt with together on how we can share and communicate pop culture, the media, environment and information. The Second World Conference will open with a dialogue for building new objectives of arts education, attaining sustainable development. These practical goals for the future of the world are our main concern. The Second World Conference on Arts Education is expected to discuss some important issues facing the world and to find some good solutions. Arts education is our primary focus for changing the future.